dots becoming southwest. Mostly sunny. Waves 1 to 2 feet. Tonight, south winds 10 knots or less, increasing to 10 to 15 knots. Welcome to this uh, VHF UHF channel. And I wanted to uh, talk about a little change I did in antennas that I'll be testing for the VHF scale. So I uh, actually put up the K180WLA antenna, which is a wideband antenna outside. Uh, it was in the front balcony, and if you are watching my shortwave channel, you know, you probably have seen my videos where it doesn't receive shortwave. It's overloaded by FM stations here in Montreal. But I actually was, um, I noticed that in the backyard it was less of a problem. It still had breakthrough, but I could receive some shortwave. So I installed it in the backyard next to my weather station. And um, so this is the K180WLA on VHF right now. So this is um, 162400, which is the NOAA weather station in uh, Vermont. The uh, antenna is actually on Mount Mansfield. And um, I am actually receiving also this one here. In effect for today, mainly so this is the Bromont uh, Estrie region Canadian weather station. So this is kind of interesting and you know I look at its reception of different signals. Um, it seems to work real well in the VHF range and I'm going to test it like this a little bit more. A little bit more, um, including on the uh, satellites, and see how it goes. Uh, hooked up the way it is, so um, you know I'm, there's going to be probably a few videos today of uh, its VHF performance, and we're going to check out what uh, what we can receive with it. So, anyways, we're going to play around with this and check out what uh, is going to be uh, on VHF, and if it's worth it to keep it outside or if I. You know, go back to the mobile vertical and the VHF range. Uh, tests are going to be done, that's for sure. So hopefully we're only going to be able to check that out. So a few changes. Uh, now my antennas are the uh, W6LVP loop on A, the MLA30 on B, and on the C antenna it's of course my K180WLA wideband. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, thank you for watching.